And seriously, like, it's just ridiculous how he's trying to claim that it wasn't the right wing doing this anti-vax stuff all the time. I mean, look at these protests. Are all of those secretly left-wingers that are trying to trick right-wingers into not getting vaccinated? So the conservatives are back on their conspiracy theory grind again, and you won't believe what they have next. The new conspiracy theory among these anti-vax right-wingers is that they were tricked into being anti-vax by a bunch of liberals, and that liberals were plotting against them to intentionally turn them into anti-vaxxers so that they would die of coronavirus. This is their new conspiracy theory, and it's obviously ridiculous in every single conceivable way. I mean, seriously, how many incentives did governors across the United States use to try and get people to take the vaccine? A $100 savings bond in West Virginia, a $10,000 scholarship in Lancaster, California, free beer in New Jersey. In West Virginia, those who get vaccinated could win some major prizes, like a chance to win a college scholarship or a new pickup truck. Today, I'm laying out additional steps we should be taking to deliver these life-saving vaccines to more Americans. We're going to provide more incentives to encourage unvaccinated Americans to get vaccinated. That starts with paid leave to get the shot. The federal government will now reimburse those employers to give their staffs, who give their staffs time off, not only to get themselves vaccinated, but also to get their family members vaccinated. I mean, you can see right there, countless offers, lotteries, free drinks, free donuts, all of these things were put in place to try and get people to get vaccinated. If liberals were trying to do some sort of meta plot to like trick conservatives to not get vaccinated, they sure as hell had a weird way of showing it. And so maybe this person is coming in with some sort of meta conspiracy conspiracy in order to trick these anti-vaxxers into getting the vaccines. But that is really is an acknowledgement of how far gone the right wing in America is today, where literally you have to treat them like they're four-year-olds where you have to use this complicated reverse psychology to get them to do like basic entry-level things like getting vaccinated and seriously like it's just ridiculous how he's trying to claim that it wasn't the right wing doing this anti-vax stuff all the time i mean look at these protests <laughs> Taking notes, buddy. Keep that little smug. We know who you are. You can leave freely, but we will find you. Are all of those secretly left wingers that are trying to trick right wingers into not getting vaccinated? No, of course not. It's ridiculous. It's utter nonsense. They've been screaming tyranny ever since the mask mandates came into place when coronavirus started. This isn't liberals plotting against conservatives to try and get them coronavirus. Republicans have been spreading coronavirus amongst each other for a pretty long time now, and they've been doing it all on their own volition because they think that basic common courtesies is equivalent to tyranny. This is Ben Carolla with Rebel Headquarters. You can catch my show Galaxy Brain on the Young Turks Twitch channel every Friday at 4 p.m. Eastern Time. You can also follow me on Twitter if you want to stay up to date with my content.